Hello, I'm Thomas Anderson, Superintendent of East Hartford Public Schools. Hope that everyone is doing well and enjoying their various fall festivities. Thank you for your continued support as we work on behalf of the children in East Hartford. I appreciate your attention for the next few minutes to briefly share some highlights. First, congratulations to Timothy Watt, third grade teacher at Mayberry Elementary School for winning the statewide 2023 Lights On After School Teacher of the Year Award. Thank you for your continued impact on the learning of all students. Also, congratulations to East Hartford High School teacher Maria White, who was recently selected by Channel 3 and Liberty Bank Surprise Squad. They surprised her in her classroom by delivering items from her wish list. Great job. Throughout October, we have recognized Hispanic Heritage Month in a variety of ways, including celebrating the rich histories through art, stories, and cultural exhibitions. Teachers have read stories in Spanish, and students have learned about influential Hispanic Americans and more about the geography of Latin American countries, which is very important. Although this information is embedded in what we do every day, it's a good opportunity to highlight. Already this year, several colleges, including Syracuse, UConn, Boston College, Vassar, New York University, and the University of New Hampshire have met with our high school students. More schools to come, so please pay attention to the announcements. To help with the college process, financial assistance is very important to access in college. Please stay tuned for details about the FAFSA, the Free Application for Federal Student Aid. The completion process so that way you can contact your child's guidance counselor for information and visit the FAFSA website at studentaid.gov. Fall sports are well underway. We have some tremendous student athletes who are exhibiting outstanding sportsmanship and character. We also recently hosted a unified sports soccer tournament with students from seven other towns. It was exciting to see students of all abilities competing and enjoying the love of sport. Your continued support of our student athletes is greatly appreciated. Please check our website to see the schedule. Also, health and safety remains a priority, especially as the flu and cold season is upon us. Consistent hand washing, hand sanitizing, and other strategies have been proven to be effective. So please continue to exercise these good habits. Again, student attendance in school every day is critical to their academic and social development. Attendance is a key factor for potential success now in school and later in life. So please let us know by contacting your school if you need any assistance in getting your student to school every day on time. We want to ensure that all families have access to fully engage in a teaching and learning process. And lastly, to our families with fourth and fifth grade students, please come learn more about our two middle schools, Sunset Ridge and East Hartford Middle School, and their available opportunities at our parent information sessions. East Hartford Middle School will be at 6 p.m. on November 9th, and Sunset Ridge's session is at 6 p.m. on November 30th. As always, we thank you for your support of East Hartford Public Schools. Thank you.